Uh, absolutely. Uh, sir, India is already considered, uh, you know, uh, a superpower when it comes to digital ecosystem in the world. And we have seen the strides that uh, India as a nation and as a digital economy has taken when it comes to, uh, you know, the online transactions, the UPI transactions, uh, the retail. Uh, now, obviously, going forward, this is only going to grow. And that requires India to keep pace with innovations which are happening around the world and at the same time, focus heavily on capacity to develop that kind of skill sets uh, in India. So, what is Government of India's plan for that? Look, I think one way of, uh, in a sense, putting in perspective uh, what our plan is also to understand how far we have travelled in the last uh, eight years since Honorable Prime Minister launched Digital India. And uh, if you remember, uh, pre-2014, when there was a conversation about technology in India or indeed the digital economy, it was almost certainly limited to the IT and ITES space, mm. and uh, which was growing well. It has created tremendous amount of economic opportunity and uh, created tremendous investments and jobs. But pre post-2014, the digital economy framework or the digital economy architecture in India has rapidly expanded and diversified to include many, many more elements. You talked about the internet and consumer tech space, you talked about digital payments, we are adding to that semicon design, electronics design, electronics manufacturing, we are talking about AI, we are talking about blockchain, we are talking about high performance computing. And so th there is almost every segment of technology that the world today is looking at as opportunities, looking at as disruptions. India and Indian entrepreneurs are present there. India is no longer an uh, uh, outlier in the digital economy of the world. It is a significant presence and a significant player in the digital economy of the world. And I would go as far as to say, Mihir, that going forward, the, the landscape of technology, the future of technology, whether it is the future of the internet, the future of AI, the future of the data economy, or whatever, or indeed the semicon and compute side of it, Indian entrepreneurship and Indian innovation will be on the round table when big decisions are being made, when big innovations are being celebrated. So it is clear in my mind that A, we are now players and we want to be players. As, as, when I say we, I mean Indian, young Indians, young innovators are essentially in every segment, slice and pie of the digital opportunity that a similar entrepreneur or a similar youngster in the Silicon Valley, in Japan, in Korea, is also uh, gearing up to pursue an address. Right, sir.